Hi, this is Vijendra Kumar. Today is 17 December 2016. Um, I am going to demonstrate my project automatic door opening system, which is guided by Mr. Anand Mahorkar. There is two more members with me, Amit Nilangekar and Ratna Pachincholi. I used Arduino microcontroller. Arduino microcontroller and Arduino IDE to program instructions to all hardwares and uh, LCD is LCD is used yeah. also there is a one sensor ultrasonic sensor that you can see And uh, there's a DC motor to drive door open and close. There's one motor sealed used to protect uh, DC motor and uh, Arduino controller because DC motor. Uh, draw more current and uh, if we control we directly control the DC motor to the Arduino board and it will draw more current then it will burn so to protect Arduino controller I used LD293 motor shield to protect the Arduino board which is based on H bridge and uh, the shield I have used can drive two motors but the, here is only one connected DC motor for the obvious reasons and there is the piezo buds piezo buds are used to state the state of the door the user can identify by audio signal and LCD will give the visual identification to the user that door is already opened and he can enter these are the connections that I used to connect the DC motor and uh, Arduino Arduino board ultrasonic to Arduino board LCD connection to Arduino board Here is one potentiometer that you can see the which uh, is not exactly used. The potentiometer in this project is already inbuilt in the here you can see the white color. This is the potentiometer which indicated here symbolic diagram. So this is the introduction to the hardware and uh, I'm going to demonstrate uh, the mechanical component this black box that you are seeing is uh, a mechanical system uh, designed in a CAD software uh, this is door this is rake and pinion uh, connected to the motor which will drive a motor which is connected to the motor and motor will drive uh, to open the door and close which will slide along this way blue strip and this is a piezo, bu piezo buzzer this is ultrasonic sensor uh, uh, here you can see the two one is a sender and one is a receiver this is the motor shield I used and uh, before below 
this is the all connection is going before behind this this is a microcontroller I will demonstrate uh, closely at the end of this video because uh, to stability of video to for the clarity I never I am not going to move my camera so I will demonstrate in the last of the video closely this is 12 volt supply which is going to motor shield here these two pins are connected for the supply and uh, motor is connected at this end these two and I am going to show you the program instruction which is root 10 in the Arduino IDE it might be not very clear now I'm going to upload this program this is connected this going to microcontroller and the program will be flashed there's some error you can see there is some error the operator xx actually let me close there is the xx remove this xx and again try to upload this the keyboard is actually placed and uh, that is unfortunately a typo error to the program program is already written this is take uh, this program written writing takes uh, 15 days of efforts and uh, almost so this is already saved in my computer now you can see the status done uploading this program is flashed into the microcontroller now sensor sensor is ready now sensor is ready to identify the object once the object is near to the sensor and uh, mode sensor it will give instruction to motor to move forward and then there is a delay of three to five second uh, so that user can enter and uh, then motor will controller will give instruction to motor to again in a reverse direction so that door will closed and uh, LCD will give the status of door open door opening closing and buzzer will once the door is opened buzzer will give beep and then it's closed it will mm, not going to be okay so here is as you can see when I put my hands near the sensor the sensor it gives instruction to the motor motor will start rotate door is opened and uh, as the door is open there is a beep to beep the user can identify there is a posh and delay the door is already open user can enter and after that delay motor again so rotating in the reverse direction door is closed uh, as you can see here I uh, give a little effort to close the door because it is my design fault that uh, dear gear design and motor arresting design is not proper if motor will be arrested properly motor will not move because when the gear is moved motor should not rotate it will be fully constrained 
and arrested so it is a design fault this is not correctly uh, industrial level design this is designed for the demonstration but there is a scope to improve this project You can see I am um, again and again pushing effort to make it close because the gear engagement is not proper and uh, this is a design fault of gear and the tolerances between this slot where the rake is moving. So the design can be improved, this mechanical design. So I am going to demonstrate one more thing. This is a mechatronic system and uh, which works on uh, four things which uh, we have learned in our lecture uh, there uh, once every mechatronic system have the f must have four essential elements so we will justify my project i will justify my project as a mechatronic system so this is a mechatronic system because mechatronic system must have the four elements first first is sensor second one is controller third one is actuator and fourth one is a mechanical component that is a gear actuation mechanical component that you can see here the gear and uh, linkage rake and pinion mechanical connections so there is a four I repeat there is a four essential component of the mechan mechatronic system which is sensor controller actuator or motor and uh, the last one is mechanical component like uh, linkage mechanical linkage here it is rake and pinion so at the mechatronic system point of view the mechatronic this project is identified as a mechatronic project and uh, there is a more uh, extra accessories which is added to the product project which is a buzzer and uh, lcd which is not re requirement which is a product requirement to identify uh, the status of the door which is open visual and uh, audio identification buzzer will give visual identity audio identification and uh, LCD will be gi will give visual identification to user that door is already opened and closed so once I'm going to uh, I'm already again sorry I'm again going to demonstrate the actuation And below this door there is a two wheels connected to the door which helps the door to slide let me take you the closer view of this component and the connections Here you can see the status of display displays 
give the visual status this is piezo buzzer giving uh, audio identification this is controller uh, this is connected to the computer which is going to flash uh, helps to flash this microcontroller here I have already demonstrated this this wire this wire this wire and this is sensor this is LD 293D motor shield board these are the Rake and PDM mechanism and here is the whole system and this is 12 volt DC supply this is 12 volt DC supply Let me demonstrate you more thing about uh, detail about this program. Uh, here we can change. There is a analog write code is used to control the motor with the PWM input. If we change this digit 72 and 73, the pulse will change and the motor number of rotation will be control we can control with this thank you this is my project automatic door opening closing system everything is going into detail in this report which is written uh, by us thank you